it's that time. So I'm going to set the timer for the four minutes. Today is four minutes. So I'm gonna do level one. You're gonna to try to get in two full, two sets of four minutes, to split out through the whole day. So the goal for level one is to get in eight minutes to spread out throughout the day of ten colds and ten pushups total. Level two, your goal is to get in 12 minutes total of plank holds and 15 push-ups. Level three, your goal total, and again, doesn't have to all be at one time or one session, is to get in 16 minutes of plank holds and 20 push-ups. That's it today. Okay, then tomorrow's the fun day where we get to be up there with our members and we have some fun with some lizard push-ups and different things, okay? So let me change my timer. I don't want the 10 minute timer. I want to set it for a four minute timer. I'll uh, keep the two seconds extra on there so that when I hit start on everything, I'm gonna pause in between. It gives me a chance to kind of stop it. Actually, I think last time I put a little bit more than two seconds. There we go. We'll put, we'll put five seconds starting time on it. That way, because when I hit pause in between, it kind of, I kind of like press a restart and so it starts going. So I hit that hit again to stop it. Yeah, that, that's what it is. That's what it is. Okay, so I don't know how we don't hold full four minutes right now the first time because I did kind of mess up my shoulder the other day um, doing some stuff. Not the push-ups, unfortunately, it was something else, so my shoulder's a little bit like ah, sore. But there's only a couple more days, so I'm pushing through the challenge to get finished. Just kind of getting that mind in even more. I have to put my mind in that you can do this, you can do this, and not lean into it and everything. And just knowing that. It's only two, after today, there's only two more days of this, and then I just need the arm workout. So it just means we're not going to be pushing it as hard push ups. And we're going to go right on into the core challenge and having fun. Core action! So, for today, yeah, we're going to get into our push ups. Our plank holds, that is, and our push ups. That's what we're doing. That's what we're doing. Okay? So, remember when you're in there. Sometimes if you have something to read or something different, you can do that too. Like I'm gonna, um, on this first one, I'm gonna flip through to see what some what motivation is for today and see if I can get that started too. See what motivation we're gonna have for today and kind of go over that while we're holding the plank hold. Mm. And, then, um, and then you can always do active plank holds. Hold it, go to this one side, hold it, go to the other side, hold it, push it back, hold it. Try to stay down in the forearms the whole time, but just kind of move around if you need to. If you're Tightening up, move around a little bit, okay? So, I had that issue with the arthritis where it tightened up sometimes too much. And for some reason, it's just stop playing. Why did it stop playing? What do we want to play now? Okay, Google, play no copyright 70s. Oh, it was 80s. Copyright 70s. Now we'll do 70s. Okay. Back. Yeah, an easy way to create professional invoices. Okay, so we're having a commercial one. We're not supposed to, but that's okay. We'll just hopefully I'll put, go into music after this. Ready for it. So we're going to start it first because I have five seconds to get up. Remember, when we come up there, drawing shoulders back and down. Am I procrastinating a little bit? Okay, well, let's get into this. Into it now. Step it back. Draw the shoulders back and down and tighten it up. We are in it. All right, timer's still going. And I'm gonna slide on it and see if it's motivation. Just be a good person. Love who you can. Help when you can. Give what you can. See if we can find that in a better image. Kind of like that one. Just be a good person. Love what you can. Help what you can. Draw the shoulders back. Come on. Yeah, that's cute. I'll lose all what we got one though. That's cute one though. All right.
We are at two minutes, 33 seconds. So, just be a good person. Don't worry about all that's going on. Just love where you can. Show love, kindness, and understanding to others. Help where you can. It's like, well, what can I do, right? Help wherever you can. Help where you can. I thought it was not going to work because oh, I guess that was what it was. This one will get better. Where'd it go? Oh, I jumped out of it completely. Come on, one minute, 37 seconds left to go for this one. Come on, hold it up there. One minute, 12 seconds, come on. So how can you show love to others? You don't want to be all mushy mushy. He says, I'm not a hugger. You got out there and hug me. I'm in a room. Don't like that. But show love, understanding, and caring to other people. Give where you can. Sometimes something small. Sometimes just giving a smile to somebody else will lift them up. And it's all they really need. So give where you can. Understand that others, you don't know for sure what others are going through each and every day. Just try to remember to understand what others are going through and be there for them. 20 seconds left. Ten seconds, come on. Five, three, one. <sighs> uh, pull back. We still have our five pushups to do. Come on up. Five push ups. Let me slide this out of the way. I always feel that with a phone there. I feel like I want to put my face in the phone. Three, two, one, two, three, four, five. Down. All right. Okay, so hold on a second. My computer's about to die. I got to plug it in. Is this a way of getting a little bit of a break? Maybe, but I'm not meaning to do it that way. Just happening. Plug it in. All right. Ah, that shoulder stretch that I was doing. Pull it over. That's one down. Level one. Yeah, I only got one more to go. Mm. I like to break it down and look at which level we're at first to kind of go that book on that one. Is that a big one? All right, so this one's going to be a little bit more active. I'm going to hold the first plank for, I'm going to go for a minute and a half, okay? Then for the next two and a half minutes, I'm going to kind of move around a little bit. I'm going to go to one side, regular, other side, regular, okay? So I'll kind of maybe go back and forth a little bit. We'll see what we're feeling when I'm doing it. Might not move as much on this one as I do the next one, but this one here, I'm going to kind of move down a little bit more. I could hold for the full four minutes. I mean, I could push through and try, but I don't want to overdo it on that. So right now, let's come on up here. Ready for it? One down. I gotta get into the next one. It's down, and it's down. We have five seconds to get into it, so we're gonna go ahead and resume. Step it back. We're gonna draw the shoulders back and down. Okay. Three, two, one. 
three, two, one. One in it. So Monday I started, I worked a little bit more on the dining room. I had to put the drywall compound on the wall where the chair row used to be that I took off um, to kind of smooth it. The sander came in yesterday, so we'll be sanding, taking the popcorn off the ceiling and sanding down the side walls, um, making flush so I could paint it. Paint the walls. I was going to do it the opposite way, but now I'm going to paint the walls. This, um, what was it? What was the thing? It was, what's the, what's the name of it? It's a white shade, but anyways, I was just trying to think of the name of the actual name of the white shade. But painting the walls a white shade. And then the board and batten is going to be more of like a green mint shade. Come on. We are at one minute and 20 seconds. There you go. Getting to that minute and a half. I think I'm gonna hold it for just a little longer because I'm feeling like I can. So right now we're at a minute and a half. A minute and 45 seconds. I'm gonna go for two minutes and then I'm gonna go to the side. Five, four, three, two, one. I'm going for the side first this time. Top shoulder's the sore one. Back to the plank. And taking it to the other side. You got this right. Back down to the plank. Less than a minute. Now I'm going to split it because I want to go to each side. So I'm going to break it up a little bit here. Two, one, side. Two, one, back. Two, one, side. And two, one, back. Four, three, two, one. Ah, down we go. Five push ups, then we're gonna do a little stretch, and level one will be done, okay? Up there, step it back. Draw the shoulders back and down. And one, two, three, four, and five. Down. All right. Stretch. Level one, you're done. Level two, you got one more to go. Come on. Level three, you're halfway through. But I was just going to focus on level. 
Three and one more. Pull it over. Ah, other side. I'm going to have a little drink. Take a little bit of a break here. Tomorrow I'm going to be pushing through to get through my workout really fast because I've got to get out to, um, tomorrow. Normally it's a Wednesday, which makes it a little bit easier, but tomorrow I get to get out there and uh, work remotely. I get to get the grandson of mine and watch and Theo. That's my daughter has some stuff going on. So... I work, but I also have that, so I'll be toting up the laptop. But I gotta get out there at a certain time, so I'm not as free in my time to get there either. So I've gotta, I've gotta get there a little earlier. So I'm gonna set them all up tonight, and I'm gonna do the best I can tomorrow to get it all in before I have to leave. Hopefully, I won't have to cut the time on something short, but I'll do my best to stay on track and get done. Now I think I've procrastinated enough for this halfway through. It's time to get in here now and get some more done, right? Yeah, we can do this. Let's set that timer. Hold the first one as long as you can. And this time I'm going to do a push back first before I go to the sides. Kind of push back into it while staying in the plank. Forearms stay on. Just kind of pushing the body back a little bit and then come back into the plank again. We can do this. We really can. We can. We can. We can. All right. Get over here. You just talk yourself into it sometimes. It's what you got to do, right? Arm down, arm down. Draw the shoulders back and down, tighten that core, tilt the pelvis slightly forward. And resume, you've got four seconds, three seconds to get into it. Draw the shoulders back and you're in it. All right, we're a minute and a half almost. Right now, a minute and a half in. We're gonna go for the minute and 45 seconds this time. Five more seconds, I'm gonna do a push back. Two, one. Small so shirt back, pull back just a little bit. Cut it into dolphin. Come back, hold it. Taking it to one side in five, three, Two, one. Come on, hold it up there. Got this. And go back to plank.
Going to the other side in eight seconds. Five, four, two, one. Back down in three, two, one. Listen, we have 15 seconds. All right, pushing it up. We get this push ups in, and then level two will be done. Ready for it. Hands down. Three, two, one. Step back. One, two, Three, four, and five. Come on down. Whew. Level two, you're done. Boom. Level three, one more. Just one more. That's it. Just one more. You can do this. Pull the arm over. Shoulder. We got one more. So, I've kind of been going down a little bit on holds for more than two minutes. A minute, 45 seconds to a minute and a half. So, I don't know, but I'm going to try to go for at least a minute and a half again, but we'll see how I get, how long I get in there. Um, no less than 15 seconds at least, so it's safe within the 15 second drop down, right? I feel how, see how I feel when I get in there? Work through this last one. All right, we got one more to go. We can do this. Put your mind in there. I know it's taking way longer, partially because I'm taking more breaks in between. But we got this final plank hold. I put it off enough that I just get in I just get it done, right? Let's just do this. Arm down. Arm down. You're stepping it back, on the shoulders back. Tighten that core, it's helping the pelvis forward. In three, two, one, step back. Draw it, two, one, and in it. I'm going to be in there. One of those on that Snapchat. I have this weird, weird thing on it. Like, I don't want to watch this stuff. I don't want my friends Snapchat and stuff. You know what I mean? Well, we're at the one minute and 15 seconds now. Holding it up. Come on.
minute and almost a half. Minute forty five seconds. Take it side. Yeah. And back to forward plank. Now. Sometimes you just have to put your mind in. You can do something. Not think about, oh my gosh, I can't do it. I can't do it. Go take it to the side. But get your mind in there. You can do it. Because you can honestly do almost anything you put your mind to. Obviously within means. But, or something that's really hard to do today, next month it might be easier to do. And everything takes time. Everything takes time. You have to learn to be patient with yourself. And understand that sometimes we have to back it down or sometimes we can push it harder. Decide. Back down. Other side. Back down. 20 seconds left. Come on, you got this. Two, one. Down it goes. All right, right into the five push-ups. Then we're gonna do stretch back. Three, two, one, two, three, four, and five. Down, pull back. Move forward. I get that shoulder. A little bit. Let's get a curl and roll. Other side. Scarecrow it. And roll into it. Oh. Get that shoulder. Stretch it out. Ah, pull back, up, arms out far in front. Pull back, up on the fingers and down. Got it done, right? One thing at a time, one one plank at a time, one moment at a time. This one here, yes, it did take a lot longer, but it is checked off. Boom, boom, and it is done.